It's a joy to be here. It's a joy to be a part of the Magic River Fair Association. And I know we're going to have a wonderful time today. Well, this year we're going to capture the magic. And I already feel the magic in the air beginning last weekend as we uh, already be have begun the events. So I know that there's a lot of things that... Uh, are available for everybody uh, in this community to participate in and I hope that you will get a schedule and find what specifically is the most interesting to you. Uh, but the main thing is to, to be here with your families and enjoy this, uh, this wonderful, wonderful 95-year-old tradition. The tradition of this uh, recognition that we will uh, announce shortly um, obviously uh, began with many other people. And they're here today, a lot of the ones that have already been recognized and honored with the distinguished citizen of our community. So I'm going to ask, I know I've seen seven or eight that I eyeballed, so if you have been one of our distinguished citizens, would you please stand and let us recognize you. What a wonderful group they are, and again, what a wonderful tradition this is. It obviously takes a wonderful group of individuals to put on a fair, uh, and they do it magnificently. And uh, they will get introduced shortly, but it's my pleasure to introduce you right now to the main man, uh, the president of the Manatee River Fair Association. Please welcome Mr. Dan Hager. Vernon. Uh, this is your second year as serving as MC, and we thank you very much. And uh, this is uh, Vernon's first year on our board. We recruited him to the board, so welcome. I'd like to ask uh, each of the Manatee River Fair Association board members to please stand and be recognized. On behalf of this outstanding group of volunteers who serve as the governing board of this great organization, I welcome you to the 2011 VIP luncheon and the kickoff of the 95th Manatee County Fair, Capture the Magic. We obviously have an outside staff that runs this wonderful organization. I'd like to take just a minute to recognize our fair manager, Mr. Dan West. Dan, are you out there somewhere? Our office manager, Cindy Patterson, and our office assistant, Wiley Rickley. A fantastic team. I'd also like to take just a minute to recognize the chairperson of today's event, which is Ina Baden. Ina, please stand and be recognized. <laughs> Obviously, it takes hundreds of volunteers and countless hours to put on such an event as the Mantee County Fair. And I'd like to take just a minute to uh, present to you an opportunity. First of all, I'd like to say thank you, thank you, thank you for all of you who spend so much of your personal time to make this the event that it is. But I also would like to invite you, those of you who are not involved, to please join us. Get involved. We have plenty of opportunities for each and every one. And if you're interested, please contact Dan West or somebody in our fair office and let them know that you'd be interested in serving in some capacity at the Mantee County Fair. This organization not only relies on its volunteers, but also the support of many sponsors. For years, the Mantee County Fair has benefited from the generosity of local businesses, many of whom are here today. This year, we have seen even greater support over previous years. Let's give them a big round of applause, please. Thank you, Manatee County. If you can feel your fingers, uh, I can't so well. It's a little chilly. It's going to get warmer. We, we know that. Our queens are hoping uh, for that as, as, uh, as I am. 
Uh, we had a, a great uh, pageant, uh, Miss Manatee County Fair pageant, last Saturday night. It was at uh, the new auditorium at Palmetto High School. Uh, great hospitality. We were very, very pleased to be there. And I think these young, young women kind of uh, are a glimpse just like the, the uh, young people that you, you'll see over in the livestock barn and all of those that, are, that have displayed their arts and crafts, these are the very best and the finest and the brightest that, that, um, that we have. And, and there's lots more where this came from because they were all in the pageant. But I'm pleased to introduce to you uh, for their second appearance, they had a great opportunity to be introduced and to meet and greet uh, our friends on the Board of County Commissioners. So, they're now very experienced. They're veterans of, the, uh, of this being on the stage. And uh, our mini Miss Manatee County Fair, she's so mini, little Kayla Gunst. Uh, she is in the second grade and she is a student at Braden River Elementary School. Can you see all those people over there? And our little Miss Manatee County Fair is Leah Roddenberry. She's in the sixth grade at St. Joseph's Catholic School. Our junior miss is Miss Dakota Shuttle. She is in the 10th grade at Southeast High School. And our Miss Manatee County Fair is Tiffany Elder. She is a senior at Lakewood Ranch High School. And at the, at the, uh, the end of her, her reign, she will earn a $1,000 academic scholarship. So thank you very much to Manatee Memorial Hospital. And thank you all for being there and here. And we will look for you at the fair. To, uh, to give us wonderful news from our Arts and Crafts Festival. It's my pleasure to introduce Fair Director and Chairperson of Fair Operations, Diana Baker. I too would like to thank the sponsors um, for their continued support because that's what makes our fair successful. I also want to thank my volunteers throughout the fair of Fair Operations for all their many hours, countless hours. And um, we obviously cannot do it without you. So we would also like to know if you would like to volunteer where um, the fair board, find a red coat, tell them that you'd like to help. Even if you don't want to be a board member, we take all the volunteers we can get. With me today is Eileen Hoffner. She is vice chairman of arts and crafts area and she's gonna introduce our top winners in the arts and crafts area. Thank you. First of all, best of show. Youth Photography, Bridget Lanier. Adult Photography, Mac Carraway. Youth Fine Arts, Chris Rees. Adult Fine Arts, Rob Kuzmitz. Youth Crafts, Ryan Abbott. Adult Crafts, Helen Glowski. Youth Culinary, Andrew Blair. Adult Culinary, Betty Glassburn. The Manatee Sarasota Fish and Game Association Award goes to George Van Boren. The Paul Bartley Award, Billy Dzwanski. The Susan Keene Awards, Kristen Hutton, an 11th grader. Sharon Dimitri, Yoko Willis, Pauline Applegate, and Jane King. The Marie Abel Awards go to Kathleen Toll, Helen Glowski, Sharon Dimitri, Jane Bell, and Maria Gordon. And please come over to the department. It will be open for a few minutes after the luncheon. Thank you. And now I'm gonna in introduce to you uh, Phil Perry, who is going to uh, share remarks. Phil is with Green, Hamrick, Perry, Quinlan, and Sherman, Shermer, who are uh, sponsors today of our uh, Distinguished Citizen presentation. My name is Phil Perry, and I'm one of the 10 lawyers that work at the firm of Green, Hamrick, Perry, Quinlan, and Shermer in downtown Bradenton. And for you fair regulars, Patrick Bryant, Tambra Varnador, and Diana Baker also work at Green Hamrick. All of us who make our lives and homes here in Manatee County are blessed because we live in a true community where people work together for the common good and help their neighbors in times of need. The Manatee County Distinguished Citizen Award is given each year to a person who has made significant and meritorious contributions to Manatee County by volunteer community service. The award committee looks for longevity, 
depth, and diversity of volunteer service when evaluating the resumes of nominees. As I look around the crowd gathered under this tent, I recognize many men and women with longevity and depth and diversity of volunteer service. Thank you for your service. My law partners and I are happy and proud to sponsor this event once again this year. Thank you for joining us today to honor the distinguished citizen of Manatee County for 2011. When you hear the word